For live performers, last month's loosening of COVID restrictions was supposed to be the start of a new beginning. But now with cases on the rise again, tension and uncertainty are growing as well. Today, as part of our Mental Health Monday series, KKL 9's Tom Waite looks at COVID's impact on bands on the rise. A hard driving vocalist on the verge of a promising career. Then on March 14th, 2020. With literally the snap of a finger, like everything changed. 21 year old Will Swanson of Granada Hills is lead singer of a band called Hunted. There's a lot of things in this life that we're all okay at, but then there's that one thing that like we know we can do really, really well. And everybody's got one thing. For Will, his unique gift is obvious. But once COVID hit, the world he and his band were building seemed to collapse. I'm used to hanging out with the band every day of the week. But with the threat of the pandemic. It was the first time that they said, we don't want to see you. On top of canceled rehearsals, canceled performances. We had the one thing that we love taken. It truly feels like I lost a part of me. Overnight, music stopped. Bruce Robb has been producing and engineering music since the 1960s. Heavyweights including Bob Dylan, Elton John, and Steely Dan have all recorded in his studio. He says when musicians stop making music together. What it does is it takes away hope. And with that, it kind of removes the idea of what's in the future for you. Over the past few months, as COVID cases declined, Will and his bandmates started rehearsing again, and Bruce started recording again. It's really hard to play music and be depressed at the same time. Two weeks ago, Hunted played its first concert, but just as things were starting to look up, cases again started to rise. While Will hopes the bubble Hunted and the studio have created will allow them to continue to safely make music, he's worried the live performances he cherishes will once again be crushed by the virus. It's not just the bands that don't want to play, it's the audience also that doesn't want to come out because they're scared, and everyone's scared. If you are a musician struggling with any mental health issues related to the pandemic, help is available. We have links on our website. Just head over to kcal9.com.